servos are, are producing the scanned image to, to do a laser projected square wave right at the moment. Although it could show other images as well. So. And so there's a, a USB adapter here. There's microcontroller. Motor controllers. Um, these are all of our power, uh, power power management stuff. And what's this over here? Um, these are the PID controllers. Uh, oh, hardware PID controllers. Yeah. Uh huh. So you have to tune those through. Is there a serial connection or something? Um, we're doing it through potentiometers. Oh, okay. So the potentiometers are right down the front. I see. Okay. And we have two one three five. Okay, <clears throat> and you hand built the servos, you hand built the high speed servos for the mirrors. The mirrors, and the ser let me get over on the side and look at the servo motor. So you have, a, you have a coil in there with a hand ground magnet, and then there's the position sensors in the back, and it's a uh, capacitance wheel. Variable capacitor again. Uh -huh. So, you want to talk about this a little bit, about the, the overall design of it? Why, why did you choose a laser uh, scanner? You choose a laser scanner because it seemed like the, a cool thing to do. Did you have any other motivation for it? I think our first thought was that we wanted to stick it on a bike. Oh, <laughs> stick it on a bike so you can draw patterns on as you... As you, as yeah. you as you as you uh, as you ride on people's cars or the cut asphalt or the yeah. idea was maybe for uh, signaling whether if you were using a GPS to get somewhere or for turn signals for, for other oh project well. project in front of yourself for or behind for for, for your own viewing right so that was the initial uh, idea uh huh and 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 you've rolled all your own stuff here. You built the motors. You've done all the circuit boards. It looks like, or most of the circuit boards. And did you, did you fab the circuit boards in house? So you, you did you use acid etch or ferric chloride etch? Yeah. Wow. So I would say you're right at the limit of complexity of what is doable in five weeks. Um, you plan on. On working on this more. It'd be nice to, It'd be nice to get the tuning. So get get it tuned and 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 then think about shrinking it down to bicycle size. Is that the? That's the plan. All right. Okay.